Hello again. We have another video card. It's on the same owner. We're gonna do absolutely the same procedure. We're gonna replace only the thermal paste without touching the thermal pads if they're in a good condition. Uh, this time we have uh, AMD Radeon 5600 XT Phantom Gaming. This is a ASRock model. So let's start. I tried, I'll try to focus a little bit, hope you can see better. Now, this card have uh, four screws here for the, for the cooler and two small ones, which I don't know, are they holding, I think they are holding some part of the cooler, so we'll see. Let's start by removing the screws, of course. We'll remove these two also. And I think this should be it. Now let's try to separate the cooler gently let's we have a cable here we have to disconnect and we're gonna disconnect the other one also that's the cooler I'll stop for a second just to clean the, the dust on the cart and we'll continue after that I did clean the cooler a little bit, I cleaned the cart, now let's start. As usual, I'm gonna use a dry Q-tip in order to, to clean some of the excess. The old paste is very dry and it's basically fragile, so We'll just use the Q-tip and after that we're going to use a brush since like this. Now we're going to use some alcohol. We're going to clean the cooler. Like this. Now we're going to apply some thermal paste. Arctic MX4 again. And now we have to put this back. First, we're gonna connect the big connector here for the fans. After that, we're gonna put the cooler back. And after that, we're gonna... Just let me see. Yeah, like this. Try to align the holes.
tie the screws and now we're gonna put the, the two screws here on the bottom and of course don't forget to connect this connector here I suppose it's for for the lights or something like that so basically that's the whole procedure of uh, cleaning this ASRock what was that uh, 5600 XT Phantom Edition I hope you liked the video that's it for now bye bye